Uh, hello again this video is an update to my previous video about the Asus Tinkerboard if you didn't watch it please check the card over here uh, anyway the main reason that I've purchased this board is to play 4k videos using Kodi on my 4k TV um, actually I don't have a, a 4k TV but uh, just in case the specs of the board are uh, it, it has a quad core uh, 1.8 gigahertz rocket chip processor uh, with a 2 giga of uh, DDR3 RAM 4k uh, decoder on board HD audio built-in Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and 1 gigabyte Ethernet in the previous video the board failed to play a 4k video but now we have an update from Asus Tinkerboard support website I've downloaded the system update which is in the time of this recording is a Tinker OS 1.6 I flashed it into an SD card using uh, Etcher the SD card is a class 10 uh, they have included the rock chip player and video playback support guide uh, I know anyway I'll, I'll explain it in a moment with a demo uh, for key videos normally you can only play uh, 4k uh, videos using this uh, player only it will not work with uh, Kodi or uh, VLC uh, they have other updates like in enabling the NFS the network file system it's a distributed file system protocol um, second reload GBIO libraries in a zip I don't know what is this exactly if you know uh, if you have knowledge about it please post it in a comment below and installing the chromium with h2645 extension i think i misspelled it but um, this is it i think this is for just better video playback on the browser uh, one one thing when i have uh, run sudo apt git update uh, the uh, chromium browser disappeared uh, I think this is an issue anyway the the system is in a beta version now and finally of course um, uh, the rock chip layer let's check the performance on the board here are video files for with uh, the 4k resolution uh, it's the famous big bug bunny movie if you remember it this is a creative common license uh, project you can find a link to that project in the description below this is where you can find the rock chip player um, I'll copy the player to the desktop double click the file and choose execute this is uh, it looks uh, sim very simple interface for better performance, change the setting to DRM from here. Uh, the rock chip layer only supports H.264 and H.265 codecs, uh, so don't try any other encoding because it won't work. Uh, this is the first sample, it's uh, 4K 30 frames per second with H.264. and actually they I don't have any um, frame per second log or uh, log from the player that I can show it to you but I think it, it's working fine I'll leave it for like 10 seconds Uh, the second sample was uh, 4K 60 frames per second with H.264. This one didn't work at all. Um, 
Well, according to the um, players, uh, the video player support guide, it's not supported to play 4K 60 frames per second H264. So uh, it is not supported, and the player couldn't handle it at all. And here is a sample for a 4K 60 frames per second with H265 video encoder. and it's working fine i leave it also for like seconds Finally, this is uh, the video I shot using my iPhone and I uh, tried to play it using Kodi in the previous video. Here is how it works with uh, the Rock Chip player. Finally, what do you think about the performance of, of this board now? Uh, tell me in a comment below. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you dislike it, you can hit the dislike button. If you like what I'm doing in this channel, please hit the subscribe button. It will be a great help for the channel. Uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you next time.